Hey guys and welcome to another the animation based tutorial. Today we're going to be looking at how a mask is used and um, what it does. So I went ahead and created this uh, symbol and um, so let's just jump right in and get started. Uh, you're going to want the layer with your symbol on it or whatever made and then you want another layer above it and then you want to click you want to put this right where it is like above it and you want to put mask now you'll notice when you um when you take the paintbrush put it to I'll say this right here if you go like that and then if you go to test movie you will see that only the bottom part that we covered up is shown now. So there's some pretty cool ways that you can uh, you can make different animations with this. I'll show you one very right quick. I'm going to go ahead and insert some frames, and then on the uh, on our mass layer, on the second frame, I'm going to insert another keyframe and color some more. And I'm going to keep doing this until I get most of the um, most of the roads colored over, and you'll see the effect that it gives. And it's not going to be the best because I'm doing this quickly. You should really actually uh, do this slowly, and you'll get a cool effect like uh, a flower growing from the bottom up. And this is also how you can create uh, some cool effects like a, uh, a vine growing or something like that. So, okay. Alright, we'll speed this up a bit. So I don't have much time. With uh, with masks, you can do uh, all kinds of sorts of things with this. It can be used um, for some neat animation effects. Like in my one of my next tutorials, I'm going to show you guys how to make an actual moving tornado, and uh, that is what we'll be using the whole time in this mask. So it's good to <clears throat> get onto it right now. So anyways, after we get this all done, we should have a pretty cool effect, and you will see in a minute why this one won't work. And uh, by the way, I'm not using the hotkeys, just so everyone can see what I'm doing, but the hotkey to make, or to uh, insert a keyframe is F6. It just made it go a little bit faster, but just making sure everyone knows what's going on. So, anyways, okay, almost there. And it's uh, kind of neat that. You can just paint like wherever you want. You don't have to keep inside the lines and stuff because the uh, masking it will only show up something that's already on the stage. So if you had nothing on the stage and you did this, like nothing is going to show up. Obviously, I don't remember where it was. Okay, I tried that one. Insert keyframe. Do one more, and we should be done. All right, we're done with that. Looks like a nice big blob of nothing. Um, I'm going to put down the keyframe rate to about, we'll say 15. And you can go ahead and test your movie. And as you can see, there's a little nice effect. 
Um, when you're doing this though, as you can see, like it kind of it's all bendy and stuff. So how you can fix that is back here. When you're doing it, you want to make the lines nice and straight. So when you're going, you don't want them to just be like all over. And yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, thanks for watching. Make sure to subscribe, rate, and comment.